Hey guys, we're going to look at the Maxpedition Roly Poly. And what really brought me to the Roly Poly is I was looking for a good dump pouch to put my empty AR-15 magazines in after a, a shooting and needed a good dump pouch to put these in, but didn't want that big old bag hanging off my leg. And so uh, I found this. Here it is, the Roly Poly. And it's a great system that holds up to seven magazines. And you ask, how in the world are you going to put seven AR-15 magazines in this pouch? Well, we're going to talk about that and the other uses, incredible uses, that this real high-quality pouch offers. Maxpedition, awesome product. Now, the concept of the dump pouch became really evident in Somalia and the need for it. And one of the things that happened, there were a group of soldiers, U.S. soldiers fighting. They encountered a large group of Somalis that were overwhelming. They had to get into a retreat mode. And as they were shooting, they would shoot, they would drop their magazines, and then they would reload and continue this all the way through. And then what happened was they started getting low on ammunition, so they called in for ammo. They had an airdrop. When they got the ammo, it was they opened up the cans. There's all this ammo on stripper clips, but no magazines. And the guys had their last magazines available, so it really put them in a bind. You need to hold on to your magazines for different reasons, but especially in combat, having a dump pouch lets you fight another day. Okay, this is the beauty of the roly poly. Pull your strap, the bag pops down. And in, pouch is ready to be used. As you can see, nice compartment. Then the flap here on this little Velcro piece comes down, fits well. You have this shock cord on the side. You can pull this, cinch it close, and core locks the, the locks here. You can really get this pouch down to where you need to. So the mags go in, but they don't pop out. Plus, there's some elastic here in the cord that helps give this some, so you can get your hand back down in there if you need to. Now, to release it, release your locks. Pull this flap out first. Of course, pull your magazine out. Pull your flap out first, because if you close it with the flap in, that's a problem. Start at the bottom, fold the bottom over. One side, one side. Then you just roll it right up. Flap over, it's back to its regular configuration. What a small little package. It weighs about five ounces. It's three by three by 1.75 or one and three quarters inches together. With it in the out position, it's six inches wide and eight inches deep. Now I'm gonna take issue with Max Expedition on this one point. And this is really the only point, but this is a point that's of serious consideration. There are seven magazines. It says it holds seven. Well, how about eight? <laughs> Nine magazines. So it actually does better than they even said. <laughs> now, you won't be able to... Well, I bet you could. You can even close this tight here. So, as you can see, incredible. As far as attachment capabilities, as you've seen, uh, it does have the belt loop here, and it's nice and wide. It could even go over a pistol belt. It's a pretty nice uh, wide. Then you have the pals or molly webbing, and you'll need uh, tack ties to go through this, or malice clips, or whatever uh, you have. But you can order these separately uh, from Maxpedition. And then also we have this little... It's called a Siamese slick clip. And the reason why it's called Siamese is because it clips, it's like a twin, it has top and bottom. But this is a neat item to hook to a vest or hook to any kind of um, attachment. And it can just hang like this. Here I've got it attached to the monsoon strap. As you can see, it just fits right over that molly webbing and there are other ways that it can clip also this does hold 190 cubic inches and so it has a lot of room in here for the size there is a small and there's also a large 
the one thing that I really want to say about this is, and I, I bought this as a dump pouch. That's the reason I bought it. But I've come to find out there are a ton of different applications. And redundancy is very important, especially in uh, survival, in a survival situation. And gear or a tool that can be used for multiple situations uh, is, is really what you want. Now, as you can see, I've had people ask me about, the, can this hold water? Because it almost looks like a water bag. Well, this has a triple uh, polyurethane coating and a, a DuPont Teflon coating also. So it's highly water resistant. That is incredible. That triple poly just keeps that <laughs> that's just beautiful one thing you want to be careful of is don't wash this in the wash machine you can just wipe it off and it keeps it clean you don't want to really use cleansers or anything it will uh, degrade the water repellent quality now, just a few other uses that I find uh, very helpful is in like brass collection if you're shooting and there's brass going everywhere. This is a great way to collect your brass and to secure it in this. Also, if you're shooting shotgun, great to keep shells in. Uh, and then, of course, when you're finished shooting them, you can roll it up on your on your pouch. Uh, th then there's just a lot of other foraging ideas. Of course, pistol mags. And, uh, you know, I've, I shot a lot of... Um, competition pistol shooting and one of the things we had to put pads on the bottom of our magazine when we dropped them and so this way you could actually drop them in your bag just like with the AR-15 magazine so a great drop pouch keeps you from damaging your magazines but the, the possibilities are endless with this bag now this is in the khaki right here it does come in black it comes in an olive green it also comes in ACU but they have some new colors out which orange red and yellow so, you know, for emergency response teams, you could have your own color according to what you use in your uniform. So there's a lot of different options with these bags. Okay, these, these little roly-polies run, and this is the medium size, $25.99 for the bag. Now, Tim at Maxpedition, when I told him what I thought about his products and how incredible they were, he told me, he said, Don, if you offer a 10% discount, if they use the discount code SOOCH, S O O T C H. S O O T C H. Use that in the discount code and it'll give you a 10% off. Now, that was on the monsoon, and I'm assuming that also with these, uh, but you know, if you order something like this, why don't you get a couple or add some things to it? Because if you get on the Maxpedition website, you are going to be just blown away by the incredible, innovative gear that he offers. So, Maxpedition, put in the coupon code SOOTCH, get an additional 10% discount, and add to your order. This stuff is great. Now, the links will be in the sidebar for the website and all the information, so be sure you check it out. Please subscribe for more fun gun reviews and sensible survival. God bless America. Long live the Republic.